Hey, what's up, guys? The Cracked iPod here with my first application review for you. Um, in this app, I have in this app review, I have three apps for you. So uh, let's get started. Okay. Alright. Okay. So my first application for you is called Sound Drop Free, a newly added app onto the iPod. It used to only be in iPad exclusive, but this one is but this one is a free version of that one. Um so basically what it is is that you have this little hole and these balls are dropping down here and uh what you can do and what you can do is you can just draw a line and make some noise in between the line you want. So it's not really a game, it's just kinda of something, you know, to entertain yourself with. You know, it's kinda of funny to hear what diff what different sounds the um, lines can make, and the lower they are, the lower the notes sound, and the higher they are, the higher the notes sound. So, uh, you know, the balls go every which way direction, and it's just kind of funny to mess around with it. Um, if there is a paid one, because I know this is called Sound Drop Free, then, um, I wouldn't recommend it, because, you know, I wouldn't recommend paying it a 99 cents or dollar, 99 cents or two dollars for this app, because there's not really much left, but if there's some extra features, and you guys can just point down in the comments for me. But uh, I just recommend the free version, you know. So, uh, you should check this out. I give this about an 8.5. But uh, you can check the ratings down in the more info section after you watch this video. So, that, again, that one's called Sound Drop Free. And as you know, it is a free app on the app, uh, free app on the app store. Okay, so my next application is another sort of entertaining app. It's not really a game. Um, if you watch the iPod Kid, application reviews. He did an application review on this one. But this is more updated version of it. And it's called Music Catch. And I I, th I believe it's an engine application review and when the when the iPod kid did it, it was a free app, so and it's gone through some you know it's gone through some uh graphical changes. And let me go to the main menu here. Hold on. So not really much to look at, you got your high score there and you got the play option there. You can look at the credits, you can look at the website, or you can go to options, do the music volume and the sound volume, and then you go back, and you click play, and you have, and you have four songs to choose from, we'll just go with gentle, and basically what this is, is just a bunch of notes coming down, and you have to catch every one, every of all the notes, and, and all the notes, and the yellow ones are good, red ones are bad, and the purple ones are just kind of like power-ups. So not really much to it, not really a skill you need, but you just use this and you can you just swipe it across. And a new feature that wasn't in the iPod Kids is you can use two hands now. You can use two fingers. So that's really cool. And, it, and, and um, let's see if I can get a purple one in here. So, so there you go. I just got some. Uh, there's a red one. Yeah, you don't really get that. You don't really get that much penalized for getting the red ones. Like it's not an automatic game over. It's just uh, see there was a problem. It's just uh, you don't get the points. But very, very, very fun, entertaining game. Not really a game, but you know, trying to pass the time. You know, if you had a stressful day and you just want to relax and do some finger swiping across your iPod. Then uh, this is definitely the app for you. But, uh, you know, is it worth spending 99 cents? That just depends on your view of it. If you think it's something that you can like, you know, and you're really good at musician, or you like music like this, then sure, you want to buy it. But if you're looking for something entertaining, and it's going to last you, and it's going to stay in your iPod for a long time, I wouldn't recommend it. So I'd give that a 7.5. But most of the points of this are good to be something called Music Catch. And it's an instant application on the App Store. Okay, so the next and final application application I have to review for you is a 99 cent application, I think, or temporarily 99 cent application. It's called Fruit Ninja. And this is a very, very, very fun application. Definitely one I, could rec I would recommend for everyone. Even if you just look at the you know, this is a full on excellent game. And it has the ability for open sync. So you get, you know, you get your creative. Uh, um, menu here, and what you can do is you have the open paint leaderboards, 
you have a new game and you have about and the way, and you don't tap on it, you swipe across, you see. But the person tells you about which is the people who made it as well as this old guy. So we're gonna make a new game. What you have is you have the classic mode and you have the Zen mode. And the classic mode is this is this is basically still flying and there's just bombs. But in Zen mode there is no bombs and it's and you only have ninety seconds, so we're gonna be in a classic mode for a little while and then I'll show you what happened and you have three lives. And you lose life if you miss a fruit. And you can get combos with flipping across this path. And you have your score right up here and it shows your best. And so there's a bomb. And if you hit the bomb, well, everything just goes boom. So you can get very tricky past the 90 mark, past the 90 point mark. But it is still fun, so I'll show you what happens when you miss a fruit. And you get one of those points. Three of that means an automatic game over, but I'll show you what happens when you hit a bomb. Boom. Everything just goes kaboom. And you can upload to Twitter or Facebook. I'm just going to quit here. Okay. I'm going to hit Zen mode. It is very fun with a time marker up here. And this and the Zen mode is just kind of like the I'm so mad at someone, I just want to like shoot with my finger. Kind of thing, because you know, you don't have any bombs to worry about. I'm trying to get a combo, I think there should be a set. Oh, darn it. There we go. That was a three foot combo. Okay. So we're gonna quit and we're gonna see some open face features. You have leaderboards, you have the you have make sure you look at your achievements that you had. See? Got Fruit Frenzy, Kill 1000 Total Fruits, Mango Magic, Go Banana, Fruit Blitz, and various others. Go back and look at the leaderboards. Classic, of course. And that just is your record. My highest is 187, so you beat me. Okay, so I'm doing the off. And you have the option to turn off the music. Or not. And, uh, so. And also have this little, um, coming soon section. So, you can know, check that out, but I give this one an, a 9.5 out of 10 because it was just an all on fun game to play. And an app that I can see in my iPod library for quite some time. And with that, that is going to end my iPod Touch application review, my first one. I'll do very more. Subscribe as well as, you know, you can email me on the app. <coughs> Sorry. Any app. Suggestions in the comment. You can put it in the comments. You can email it to me. My email will be over here, and as well as my Facebook account, if you want to post anything like that on there. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, subscribe, please.